Today we are all the way up in northern Iceland in the beautiful village of Husavik, also known as the whale watching capital of Iceland. We did receive a disheartening email last night that said, Lately we have had irregular whale sightings in the bay, meaning that some tours have seen whales, whereas others have seen little or nothing. But today, we're going to be hopeful. Let's go see some whales. Even if we don't see any, we're going to be on like sailing on a traditional oak boat. There's a couple different options you've got in Husavik. You can go out on like a rib boat, like one of the small inflatable boats that are really fast and you can get around the bay really quickly. It was like twice the price and we we're reading online that the whale sightings have been in and out and I was like, well, let's save some money. We'll go out on the cool traditional oak boat. Hopefully no seasickness today. Hopefully, yeah. I got seasick when we were in Croatia. Hot. All suited up. Tight squeeze. Yeah, these are definitely a lot easier to put on than they were in Norway. They're not as thick. Remember all the fuzzy gloves and yeah. stuff under the gloves? Hat was the best part though. <laughs> oh, it's so tight. Alright, I'm ready. All suited up. I'm ready to go see some whales. telling us that they don't have any special equipment to spot the whale. They look for the blow, which is where the whale breathes out all the air and condensation, and they can see it up to 10 meters high depending on the whale. If you look at one o'clock after the line, you can see there is a clear mark in the, in the water now, it's almost 12 o'clock. They said that they think they saw whales a little bit farther that way, so we kind of sped over here and we're slowing down now, so hopefully they still see them. There was just a speedboat that was like launching over the wave. This is a minky whale, a little bit on the right side of the factory. A little bit before this clear line you can see through in the water again at the surface. We just saw a mink whale. The mink whale is also nicknamed the sneaky mink. So it's gone underneath the water quite a bit, but it has popped up twice already and we've seen it pretty well. Hopefully it comes back. were just surrounding us coming in and out they're called the white tips usually only live up here in the North Atlantic so like Greenland northern Iceland uh, it was really cool to get to see them I didn't even never heard about that species they were beautiful coming out swimming around jumping shelling off for us it was a pretty successful day I would say I'm about to book be a cowboy or something. Cool. Just put on my chaps. <laughs> the boat keeps rocking and rocking and rocking and rocking. Open your nose, start smelling around you, and if you start like smelling like a very, very, very bad, bad fart, okay, it's not your neighbor, or it's possibly your neighbor, but it's more likely to be in the way. 